we had a little bit of a kitchen disaster. Water everywhere. It's everywhere. Oh God. Mm. <clears throat> Apparently the dishwashing machine hates us and decided to spew itself all over the floor, which is wonderful because we've been here for two days <laughs> and we're already fucking shit up. Ah! Oh well, nothing we can do, except eat some chocolate. You want some chocolate? Yeah, okay. So that is all cleaned up. Something is wrong with the pipes. They're backed up or something. I don't know. I don't know how we're going to fix it either, but right now it's just pumping into a bucket all of the dirty water. So we'll live with that for the moment. Um, and then there's this, which is probably the most beautiful thing that I'm going to see all day. Are you ready? Oh my God. Look at all of it. Oh my God. It's so beautiful. I don't think you realize if you have ever lived like not with your family, but like as a roommate to people, not having your own fridge just all to yourself is <laughs> really horrible. It's really bad. Like the first place that I ever lived in by myself, not by myself, but that wasn't with family, I didn't put anything in the fridge ever because the fridge was so dirty because nobody ever cleaned it and everybody was just leaving filthy food in there and oh you couldn't and then the second place that I lived in I don't know I just I've never felt like it was my home so I never felt like leaving things in the fridge and I'm pretty sure my housemates would have eaten it yeah and then the last place that we went to I just I've moved so much in the past two years <laughs> but the uh, the last place that we went to we only had half a fridge to ourselves and now we're here and this is our own flat and this is my fridge and that's all of my food I'm gonna eat that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drink that for sure. I'm gonna eat all of that. I'm gonna eat that down there. I'm gonna drink that. I'm gonna eat that. Gonna eat that. Gonna eat that. Gonna eat all of that. Gonna eat all of that. Mmm. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> We're going yeah. to the greatest place on earth. There's no IKEA signs that I can show you. I was expecting this to be a really like it is there. It's there. an amazing magical moment. That's all that you can see right now, which is not much, but we're going to gay heaven. Ah. We're gonna pick up. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was a mirror, but it's not. <laughs> Look at the table arrangements. I'm in heaven. This is everything that I want it to be. I want to just come and live in Ikea. <laughs> Look at the band-aids. Right next to the really sharp knives. This is the coolest place I've ever. But let's take a look at what we got. Obviously, I've seen the cookies. A little drawer to put our cutlery in. Okay, we got three of these little jars. We're putting like flour and sugar and other junk junk in. A little placemat thingy. Then we got a water bottle. Egg cutter. It just cuts your eggs for you. Okay, I cleared some space. Some beautiful silver bed sheets. Silver, gray, gray, silver. Opinion? What? Opinion? You never listen to me! <laughs> <laughs> and then to go underneath that, some beautiful green sheets. Green and gray, love it. Cake spatula, and I don't know what that's for. For brushing things. A little something to hold the spices in. 
little something to mash the potatoes with. Shower caddy. A little thing to whisk your anus with. Whisk your anus with. Some storage boxes. And then a cutting board for cutting up penises. <laughs> Most important buy, beer and wine are on Beautiful tray, really boring, not really worth anything. Smile. Oh wow, do you have some fresh baked cookies for me? No, fuck off, right? Okay. <laughs> Delicious. The cookies look nice as well. <laughs> and then we got some wine glasses, which are really beautiful, really cheap, really cheap. And then finally, we got this lovely frame to put a very classy picture that our photographer friend Aaron made for us for Christmas. And that is everything. We are making, you probably can't see me. Can you see me? Yes. Okay. <laughs> we are making this house a home. This house already feels a lot like home, but it feels a lot better now. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Where are we? We're back for round two. Wow. This time we stopped in the cafe and got meatballs and cake and schnitzel and waffles. Mm. This is the fattest moment of my life. Ready? Let's go. So basically, we were at home and Miguel decided that he was tired of the mess and so he picked up a table and threw it at the wall and said, I can't stand this anymore! Something in Spanish, I don't know. Anyways. <laughs> and so we're back for a desk and for some boxes and things like that so that we can store all of our shit because we brought so much shit. And that's all. Okay, bye. Just really quickly, I want to show you this because we were talking about going out tonight, like going to a bar and maybe to a club afterwards. Um, and it's currently 12 o'clock midnight. And uh, let's take a quick look. My anaconda don't, my anaconda don't want none unless it's the precious hun. Oh my god, look at precious. Oh my god, look at precious.